This is the data line connecting the original navigation display. And this is the iDrive knob box. After unpacking, there are two fixing screws and two buckles inside. Put the buckle between the screw hole of Android system and base and lock the screw. Please note that the protruding part of the buckles points to the front of the Android device. Pry in and take out the air conditioning decorative panel. Press the plug buckle to take out the connecting plugs on the back of the air conditioner decorative panel, and then place the air conditioner decorative panel on one side. Pry off the cover plate under the decorative panel of the air conditioner with a rocker, and take Remove the fixing screws of the main engine panel, take out the connection plug on the back of the main engine panel, and then place the original main engine panel. Remove the fixing screws of the original car host. Pull the host outwards, and take out the host, then pinch the buckle of the harness and pull it back, then take out the power harness. Pass the 4G antenna, GPS antenna, and USB cable through the passenger seat storage box to the back of the Android device. Tear off the 4G and GPS antenna glue paper, and paste 4G antenna and GPS antenna in the front windshield of passenger seat side. And place the USB cable at the position of the passenger seat storage box. Pry and remove the cover plate of the keyhole. Connect the Android harness to the male connector of the original harness, and press the buckle firmly. Connect the male connector of the Android harness to original host. Install the original host back to its position, lock and fix the original host. Restore the connector of the main unit panel to its original position. 
Press firmly to ensure that the locking pin is in place, and then lock it with four screws. Connect the Android harness, 4G antenna harness, GPS antenna harness, and USB harness to the back of the Android device. Connect the original LVDS cable to the Android device. Install well the Android device to the original car, and fix it. Restore the connection plugs on the back of the air conditioner panel, and put the air conditioner panel back in place. Start the car and check whether the Android device can power on or not. Check the touch function, navigation, Bluetooth audio and video functions.